Hey, more Dragon Guard. We're going Still to Mount Whatever. Whatever. Yeah, whatever. Let's see how fun this aerial attack is, guys. Aerial evading. We don't aerial evade. We aerial attack. Yeah, really. <laughs> The jewel bearing the revered one ascends to the heavens from Mount Bernstein of the Vice Morden, leaving a silvery shadow in its wake. Following the stone's message, Zero and company made their way toward Mount Bernstein of the Vice Morden. Though named for a mountain, Mount Bernstein of the Vice Morden is actually a man made fortress located in the deepest part of the range. Feeling less than enthused by the length of the name Mount Bernstein of the Vice Morden, the group decided to refer to it as Mount Whatever instead. I mean, I wouldn't want to keep calling it that. Mount Vice Norden. Mount Vice Norden. Mount Norden. <laughs> A lot of mountains. Mount <laughs> Whatever. Ah, right. pulling a Donkey Kong immediately go left. Yep, gotta go backwards. This mount's tiny. I think it has multiple floors because it's a tower. I figured that's what it was. Oh, it's like the pagoda tower we did in Minecraft. Oh, yeah. That was really fun. That was a ton of fun. I think it was huge. Because it's cold and you smell like a dead bear's ass? Let's think about that plan for a second, shall we? Alert the rear guard. Now, and go from cold to extremely hot. Kill her. That's it. Boring. We should have a little fun with her fur. Like her greatest chin, and then tell everyone she knows until she begs you to kill her so the humiliation can finally end. You're a sick puppy, aren't you? Oh, thanks. <laughs> All right. Of course, that's why he oh. hung out with five. Drew's doing the move. Uh, it's very useful. It's cheap. It's good for breaking boxes. It's good for breaking anything. Enemies, boxes. You know, parry an arrow and look cool, Drew? Yeah. There you go. Oh, you look sick. Thanks. I was, <laughs> oh, I was the coolest gamer right there. That looked terrible. <laughs> you took an arrow in the knee. <laughs> oh, ho, 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 2011. Uh, good old Skyrim. Damn. Maybe we'll record that one day with... Yeah, With okay. tons of mods, okay? With 900 mods, and it's not even recognizable anymore. And that's not even half the mods on the on the Nexus for it. <laughs> it's got, like, oh, spirits, so I gotta uh, kill him quick? Not quick, looks like. Just kill him. But before the they are a so body. annoying when they possess a body. Uh, such a pain yeah, zero, you're in my mind. Ow. Not a bad strat. Ow. Cool icon for spirits over there looks cool. Oh yeah. This is an epic skull. Gotta kill the spirit. No! God damn it. Oh my god. Yeah, see, the spear is really... That super armor is really, really I wonder annoying. if the spear just doesn't care about it. He tried. I couldn't tell. I couldn't tell either, actually, because it looked like the spear fell out of him. I think as soon as you hit him, the spirit came out. Try it on that guy. He's got some HP to spare. Okay. Nope. nope, he doesn't care. Or at least the attack gets you out of the way at the same time. Spear's okay. I was kind of wishing it would be a little faster. Maybe another moveset is. Yeah. It is supposed to be the slow power type. Usually spears are pretty quick. Because you just, you just do a bunch of stabs. Like a rapier. They're usually really nimble. Who do I know? I like it when games let you throw spears. That makes them fun. Yeah. Some, them. some games do. A lot don't. Fire Emblem? Yeah. Javelin. I was thinking of Valheim Javelin. too. Valheim. Anytime you craft a spear in that game, you can throw it. Per game. Heals? For some reason, 
Twitter thinks I like to hear about Fire Emblem. Who puts that topic on there all the time, and all it ever is is bikini fan arts and the phone game. Nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh, I saw platforming. The, I saw the schedule for the phone game, and I was like, this is impossible to read. There are so many different things going on. It feels like a new event every two days. No, yeah. just all this stupid precision jumping. <laughs> You're on thin ice, buddy. I feel like he's overshot. always on thin ice. <laughs> he's always on thin ice. She doesn't like uh, platforming in, a, in an action RPG. I mean, yeah, fair. Just like I don't like the platforming in Dark Souls. Let me guess. It's something stupid, right? No. It's too platforming Bloodborne. That's what it's all about, right? Yep. Because that game still did the stupid thing from Dark Souls 1, where you click circle twice to, to jump. When you're running, you want to roll. You the jumping. That was so dead, so bad. Yes, it was. Uh. Oh, I'm running around. I'm fighting this boss. I need to dodge. <laughs> what? I like the games that map the jump to stick. Yep. Or yes. even better yet, Sekiro and Elden Ring, where it's just the X button. You jump. Jumping so much better in those games. Good thing she has a ledge grab. Yeah. God damn it. But she has like... Do you agree with her, Drew? You don't like all this jumping? Nope. And the developers are aware that she's... They're aware. The fact that she criticizes this... <laughs> they were very aware through the whole game. You triangle move, you'll get over there. I didn't want to overshoot it. There we go. Ah, too high. I can't believe it. So do the first two games have the same style of writing? No, the other the other two are not even funny. They're just all serious. Yeah, all they're just all serious. Because this one took a very comedic note. Oh, yeah, I hate archers. Go away. Hate me fire them too, huh? Yep. They're shooting my Pegasi. <laughs> Tyler, I'm getting hurt. Just give him an IO shield, bro. Guys are dying a lot today. Come on. It's the These spirits. spirits. The spirits were rough. Yeah, I didn't have to deal with those. They're... It's just super armor. And just imagine every little grunt in the Dynasty Warriors get super armor. That'd be awful. It's very awful. And they can survive more than two hits. Because <laughs> in that game, they do die in, like, two hits. Oh, it's another oh, one. Super race. Not this stupid mud again. You fought one in Castlevania, now you fight one here, too, Drew. Did you yeah. fight him in Kingdom Hearts when we played Kingdom Hearts? No, I, well, well, I don't I think Tyler did. Ah. Uh, I remember Tyler always called the Coliseum. He loves the Coliseum type. I do. do it's my favorite thing. area of Thousand Year Doors, my favorite area of Kingdom Hearts 1 and 2. Couldn't you come up with something a little less cliche? What are you bitching about? And who are you bitching to? <laughs> yes, yeah. He's, he's bitching to the fourth wall. That's why. <laughs> Sounds like a stay and fight. What do you think of her language, Johanna? Do you like it? Zero's bad language. It's how Johanna talks. <laughs> yeah, it sounds like Johanna. <laughs> what are you bitch about? <laughs> you stupid pussy snow. Jesus Christ. Whatever it was she said. Yeah, that's what you called it. I didn't even yell that loud. Nothing's ever her fault. <laughs> nope. <laughs> yeah, how it is, she's perfect. Whoa. This is cool. Whoa. You're playing a character with long hair, a sword, and a big cape, fighting Cerberus? Yep. What game am I talking about? What game? What game? Okay, you mean? Oh, yeah. But Alucard's a bit cooler. He is really cool. I like him. This girl doesn't say so steel. No, nope. she just... She so just swears at everything, and she's always upset. <laughs> she is. There's hey, Mikhail. there's your boy. Secret treasure room.
But Kale's always exactly where he needs to be. That's right. All times. Hey. Checkpoint. Thanks. I still have only found... I don't, I don't know if I found two yet or not, but I know I found one chest. I wish this time Mikhail would fly you to the top, though. The previous excuse of it gets colder when you go up doesn't work if you're going up the tower. Going up anyways? <laughs> yeah. You're going up anyways. Outside. <laughs> go ahead, fall back. You're not going to be able to fall back. Nope. You go to leagues. I assume if they saw you flying up to the top, though, they would gather all the forces up there. That might be a little hectic. Also assume though that if they saw her running through these stairs and they know how high she jumps that they get taller barricades, you know, by a. Yeah. It might be hard to wheel it out, but you just <laughs> hop right over. I thought she said, I don't want to ride you because you smell. I mean, she always says that. She's like, you smell bad. Ooh, the snowstorm cleared up. Damn, I ringed him out. You see that? Yeah. <laughs> so caliber. Oh, that game is crazy. I didn't even know you could do that. Soul Calibur is, I don't want to ring out the game. You ain't even worried about dying, you're worried about ringing out. Just like Smash Bros. Don't ring me yeah. out. That that's, game that's ring. That's the only way to kill people in Smash. Come on, Brandon. In Soul Calibur, you ring out a lot. <laughs> a lot. That game's terrible about it. I mean, unless you like it, that's part of the game. Oh, boy, not more. Oh, gee. Like no reason why these are floating. It's just to piss her off. You've got to be kidding me. More jumping? Who's the asshole who designed this place? And hang in there, Zero. Hang in yeah. Nomura, Settle the down, level designer. You? Nomura laughing in his grave. Nomura, you he's not in the grave. No. <laughs> <laughs> but you know, if you're terrible, Yoko you gotta Taro blame him. Did, did he actually, Yoko? Familiar. Yeah, it's the same guy who made oh. new games. Oh yeah, you did say it's in the same universe. Yoko Taro is known to be a troll, though. Yep. This whole game is a troll. Oh, not again. He's the owner of that month from before. He really does look like Heartless. Don't know, don't care. Mikhail. Do you parry him? Where's Mikhail? It's I'm not okay parry if him. he looks like a Heartless. It's the same company. Yeah. Damn. Kale just killed everyone. He doesn't remember either. Even Dito didn't even remember the name. Ow. Oh, there's a free heal over there. Okay. He's a pretty cool enemy design. I like his awakening feet. Pose. His little nubs. Drew's going for the mess him up strat. Yes, I am. Hurry up and die. Almost killed him with it. He was already a quarter down, so he did like a little over half HP total. Good. Well, I wonder what visceral. I, I am by hitting his head. That's just the visceral. Yeah. There you Ooh, go. Ooh, you cut his head off. I wonder what makes him topple like that. Because when Brandon fought him, he didn't do that. Maybe you have to I hit know. a certain body part. I'm a kill. Close to the top, aren't you? Should be. Hey, look at that. It feels like you are. A weapon! Ooh, we haven't gotten a weapon time, all day. Oh, click it now? Damn, you can now, you have to do it between hey, missions. I can go too if I were dressed like that. I can't take it. Here, give me your clothes. What? Why? They won't even fit you. I'm not wearing them. I'm gonna have dummy burn them for warmth. You really are a demon. He just clothes as fire fuel. <laughs> This looks like the top to me, Tyler. This looks like the boss. I don't know. It's just gonna be an elevator that goes all the way back down. You have to go all the way back up. I'll be on 
almost blow out. Oh, hell. The sky? Never even considered that. The well, last Antoner yeah. fight was on a dragon. Is this one uh, also on a dragon? It's cold and you stink. But I suppose there's no choice. There's no choy. Choy. She didn't get to finish hers that time. Emulator's being weird today compared to last week. All right, well, in the next episode, we're going to go get four who's no in the sky. Oh, 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 damn! Oh, it's a spear. A you got princess. a new spear. I wonder if it's a new size spear. I hope so. Maybe See you in the medium. next one.